Hey guys, today I'll be unboxing and doing a short video on the Vaxxus Atom 500 SDI. Not too long ago, Vaxxus came out with an Atom 500 HDMI version, which I did a video on previously. It was only time until Vaxxus would release an SDI variant, and that time is now. This is the Atom 500 SDI. The Atom 500 SDI is a 1 to 1 system that has 500 feet of range, less than 80 milliseconds of latency, and iOS monitoring with hopefully Android support coming very soon. This video won't go as in depth as my Atom 500 HDMI video where I test out the range and the latency as the HDMI and SDI versions are basically the same units and same internal specs. but. They did make a few changes and upgrades to the SDI version. Unboxing the unit, you get the transmitter, you get the receiver, and a USB type A to USB C cable for powering the unit. Looking at the receiver, you have a quarter 20 mounting point and the power switch on the left side. The back side has a Sony NPF plate, which is upgraded from the HDMI version. It has a small metal piece that applies pressure to the battery so there's less chance of the battery accidentally coming off. On the right side you have of course your SDI out, your HDMI out, and your USB-C power. On the transmitter you have all the same mounting points. You have SDI in, HDMI in, and USB-C power. Another upgrade over the HDMI version is they made the buttons stick out more and are very, very clicky and they're way more satisfying to push. The buttons on the HDMI version are very mushy and flush with the unit, making them very hard to click, so this is a very welcomed upgrade. I was able to use the Atom 500 SDI on a corporate job where we had a Ronin with an FS7 and I was focus pulling using the 500 SDI receiver. We were in a factory running all over the place and the 500 SDI worked great with a stable image the whole two days and the minimal latency was acceptable to be pulling off a monitor. Overall, the Atom 500 SDI is a super solid lightweight one to one system that's a great addition to Vaxxus's inexpensive wireless systems. If you need a system for wireless viewing for a director monitor or sending out a feed to clients or other people on set via their app, then the Atom 500 SDI is definitely a great option in the wireless world. I hope you enjoy the video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.